Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel and welcome to my first Guitar Friday. I hope all of you had a good week and will have a wonderful weekend and I hope it can start with some good music for me. So today I will be checking out another one by Tina S. I was a little bit hesitant, just a little bit, because some people really hated me for not loving comfortably numb that much i mean she she was great like don't get me wrong but i just didn't like the guitar as much as um as the original that david gilmore plays live it's just hard to beat for me that uh live performance from the pulse it's just one of the best i've ever seen in my life for my personal taste um but I mean, she was she was pretty amazing with her third movement of the Moonlight Sonata. So I definitely wanted to hear another one. And this one is also going to be a song that I don't really know. Um, Steve Vay cover for the love of God. I don't think I've heard it, so that's good because and a little bit more exciting probably just because I've never heard it. So and of course, like always, if you haven't watched it and you like it then please check out the original and give it a like. I will put the link into the description box down below, like always. And that's enough talk. Let's get into the music. Okay, right, right from the beginning, uh, I feel like this one uh, sounds much better on this guitar. Just works much, much better on this. I love her artificial harmonics. It's great so far. Let's go. <laughs> Her feel on this one definitely this this one is great um i like it much more than comfortably numb already just like i said i think the guitar sounds much better for this one and she looks a little bit more relaxed like with the last one like with comfortably numb maybe she was much younger and that's why i felt like her nervousness and just um the tension in her body made it look a little bit less sovereign than this one uh, but this one is great so far let's go <laughs> Thank you. 
we'll go back a little bit don't worry yeah this one's great i love it absolutely i think this one is perfect um her bendings her bendings are so on point and actually everything that she does i think like is uh, absolutely on point on this one it's great i love it <laughs> I will run that back. I want to hear it again. This was this was pretty amazing. That was sick. Um absolutely love her feel on this one and I mean, I don't know the song, but it didn't sound like me. There was just just a single wrong note on this one. This was absolutely great. Let's go. <laughs> This is this is absolutely amazing and this one is really perfect i there's absolutely nothing you could ever critique about this one this is absolutely mind-blowing and for me by far the best from her that i've heard so far i mean moonlight sonata was technically probably as impressive as, as this one but just not the song for me but this one is this one really hits me. I love it.
Yeah. This one was sick. This one was... Yeah, this one really got me. I understand now. Like, I mean, she was technically super impressive on the third third movement of the Moonlight Sonata. Gotta be honest, I wasn't the biggest fan of the Comfort Libby Nam cover. Not so much because of her, just because uh, the sound of the guitar and the pickups and the stack distortions on it uh, wasn't for me. I uh, prefer the original, but this one is for me on a completely different level. That's a completely different level. And yeah, like I said, I I felt like, or I feel like that with her cover of Comfortably Numb, she was uh, much younger and maybe not so much used, well, much younger, a little bit younger, definitely, and maybe not so much used to to the camera. And she looked a little bit tense. And that might have been what made me feel like um, she struggles a little bit with the slow notes or just holding the notes without using any vibrato because sometimes especially when you're tense and nervous it's much more difficult to just let the note ring instead of doing anything with it but this one man this one was for me a completely completely different level and i absolutely loved it i loved her feel the bendings were all so much in point with the artificial harmonics. The shredding part was absolutely mind blowing and so much feel in this one. And yeah, for me, undoubtedly, like no contest, this is my absolutely favorite from her so far. And this was sick and absolutely amazing. Yep, great way to start the day for me. Um, let me know if you have any more like this from her, because I really love this one. Great way to start the day for me. And I hope that you also like this reaction and have a great day. See you next time.